Which place should we wander now? we got three bonding points left. You know what, I'm going to go bond with a boss. Hey boss. No, she's not our boss, but she's our teacher, which is pretty much the same. Spend some time with Teach. Well, seeing as total of miles are here, I'm guessing all the braces in here and over only are probably okay. Wish I could say the same for Connie because I've been crossbow though. Can't even get in touch with Wenzel. And yours? You go back a ways, yeah. Used to be rested as a bracer here, but eventually he packed up and moved to crossbow. Anyway, leave Warring Rap Guild to us, you've got enough on your plates as it is. Just focus on what your moves are going to make me next. Feel like you need a break, I'm happy to join you. That sounds nice. Actually, would you be mind hanging out a while? I was actually thinking of heading to a tavern for a drink or two. What'd you say for a little change of venue? That's fine with me, but I'll stick with living a dry life. I figured you'd say that. Come on, then. Of course, the teacher wants a drink. No sooner we arrived at the tavern, did Sarah ask Gerald for our common recommendations? And after she offered to pay, Reen settled on a ginger ale. Ah, this is good stuff. Got a very, very mellow taste and sweet and refreshing as well. No idea you can make something so good out of rice. I should get some sake. It's kind of alcohol from the East Master Car Fire breaking up here, I believe. Gerald says it's called Jun Mai Shu. Master Car Fire knows this stuff. Sounds like a man I'd love to drink the night away with. He's always been a bit of a heavy drinker, so I'm pretty sure he'd take you off a mat if you asked. You might want to put it down on the booze. Things so shaky now, you never know when you need to take action. I know, I know. I'm not planning on getting myself plastered while you got that discussion later on. So don't freak out. I think I've earned a bit of alcoholic relaxation time, personally. After all, I went cold turkey while I was in hiding. It was torture. Would you deny your sweet, poor instructor some sweet, sweet relief? Sure. Relief. Let's call it that. What have you been doing all this time, anyway? We didn't hear so much of a rumour about you. Oh yeah, I was just lying low, gathering what information I could through connections with my guild years. Information about what was going on elsewhere, the country, the capital, that kind of stuff. The capital? Trying to find anything out? No more than you did yourselves, I'm sad to say. Noble Alliance is doing a great job of keeping information from leaking out. After that, I decided to sneak into a cruising province to follow the Alliance's movements there. But that's when I ended up getting in contact with Juicy's. Pretty impressive how you're able to do so much on your own, though. Well, working alone, gathering information is two things I had to get used to during my guild years. Just nothing new to me. If anything, I'm more impressed with everyone I think you've managed to do. I was glad to say everyone here was doing okay after the Jaeger attack. Sounds like it was fairly high ranking core. Yeah, the Northern Jaegers under orders from Duke Alborea. Fortunately, there were no fatalities, even if the experience was pretty traumatic for everyone. Dad's working up now, too, so there's been no real long term damage. We have a goddess's blessings in that respect. I'm sorry I couldn't be there to help you when you needed it, most mean. No need to apologise, you couldn't have possibly known what was going to happen. Is it wrong? You look distracted. Oh, it's nothing. I was thinking about what it was, Leaf was okay, your dad's okay. He always seems like you're such a pleasant man. Especially noble, handsome too. I don't like where this is going. Oh, relax, I'm just kidding. Anyway, all aside, you've made it this far, you can make it rest away too. Keep your eyes on the future, and that starts by deciding what to do next. Ah, this stuff is awesome. Can you at least let me finish before you want to pass out on the floor? Hey. More bonding, please. All right, time up for it. You are? Attaboy, Reen. Actually, since we got played in the morning left for a way, got an idea. We'll take you a little one-on-one -on -one training. Sounds good to me, just maybe don't rough me up too much. Well, let's take this up somewhere else.
<sighs> You've definitely got a stronger one, I've been away. Good to see we get around night of yours. Doesn't cause you to start slacking. I still want to match for you, though. Heading back, but only just. I think I might, if I really try, I might be able to beat her. She clearly wants me to do it, and if that's what she wants, I'll show how much I've improved. Hey, you're fired up now, and out of it any other way. Let's pick things up where we left off. Come on, is that all you got? Hope it isn't, because you're going to be able to rescue your sister of a princess, so that's the best you can do. You remember when I said you were a centre of class 7, right? I still feel that way, even now. And I won't rest easy until I know that centre's capable of beating me on his own at least once. He's... Ugh. <sighs> oh. I'm sorry, you right, Reen? Yeah, I'm fine, it's just... I'm sure no one has no match for you. Whew. Now it's your victory, not mine. What do you mean? I knew that last time you attack of yours was going to be far more powerful than I thought you were capable of. So I was forced to stop holding back in order to block it. That's a victory in my book. Clearly all that stuff you've been doing is great for your training. I really like to think so. I took around not to look personally, I wasn't even thinking. It was more like my body acting on its own. I need a lot more practice before I can pull off feats like that again. If you understand that, then I need to say no more. But don't worry. I'm sure if you train enough, you'll be able to do it. Have faith in yourself, okay? Both potential and a mindset to achieve great things. I'll try. I'm exhausted. The pair went back to the village. I don't even want to think about how badly that last attack could have hurt him. I feel like this was causing me all me to resurface. Mm. I've got one more thing we should spend it with. I don't want to spend it with one of those guys. Or him. Uh, could do Laura, could do. You know what? Sorry, sorry, buddy. Cutie over here needs me. <sighs> Captain Claire? There's something wrong? Hi, hey, Ian, it's nothing major. Just received an update from one of my men. Contains some information. Oh well, I won't pry. The risk of sounding condescending, trying to push out too hard. So one of few chances we'll get to rest. I appreciate the concern. I tell you have bigger things to worry about than my well-being, like the future of Class 7. If the town's dependent as solid as they are, now's a perfect time to sit back and figure all of that out. Well, since we're both defenders, pretty well defended, why don't we take a little white break? A bit is on Phoenix Wings, if you're interested. Well, given how many people are trying to keep the town safe, I'll take up on my offer. I can't believe we just pocketed all the balls in one shot. Unfortunately, they moved exactly how I calculated as they would move. I'm sorry, I ended up a game before you and I had a chance to take a shot, haven't I? I'm thinking about it, games like these seem to be exactly the kind you'd be good at. Probably walk into a bear trap the moment I invited you. Granted, I should at least try to hold back a little. Sorry. Lecter would have done a better job of making a game more enjoyable for both sides. All while I'll leaving certain elements up to chance while keeping things interesting. That lines up with him, my impression of him too. Always did peg him as a bit of a trickster. Still, I wish I was a better player. Be able to put a halfway decent fight in that case. Well, I'll about to give you a few pointers. You don't mind? Not at all. Teach some valuable skills that are guaranteed to help. I could use them, it'll be down to you, but I shall allow you to improve your score. Are you sure you don't mind? Sure, why not? Go for it. Oh, that's nine ball pocketed as well. Thanks, to be honest, this is the first time we've been able to pocket all the balls without making a single mistake. You really are a natural at teaching. Wouldn't have been able to do anything at all if you weren't such a capable pupil. If you have any other questions, feel free to ask. 
Happy to keep practicing with you up to it. Really? You're a kind person, Captain. What makes you say that? It's true you went out your way to help us countless times on the field studies. And now you've chosen to accompany us here and help us protect the village. It's easy to forget sometimes you're part of the RMP or an Iron Blood. Feels like you're always there watching over us from the shadows, and I really do appreciate that. I think you're overstating how much I've really done. I'm a force graduate as well, after all, so I can't help but want to look out for others from the academy. In some ways, I just want to act like I'm still there, looking out for classmates like an upperclassman would. Well, whatever your reasons, that doesn't change the fact I'm grateful. I can't say for sure, seeing as I only have a younger sister. If I had an older one, I've got a feeling she'd be just like you. That's not what she wanted to hear, mate. Captain? What was that all about? Don't mind me. Please, try to think of it as nothing more than a meaningless gesture. Well, if you say so. Regardless, I intend to continue doing whatever I can to aid you in the future. My primary duty may be to serve a railway military police, or to carry it with one of our Chancellor Osborne. I have no reason to believe that I'll ever be anything other than the ally to you in Class 7. Wonder about any other way. Now I know I can help, you can give us a long way to go for us. Hey, bond up. You got counter attack, do you? As well. I believe that's all the bonding events done. Mm. Yeah, nothing to do there. Nothing else left to do. I've done the um, way down there. I can't go to any of those buildings in grey. Really worth going to a chapel about. That's so but surely. Oh, that's cute. Uh, well, I say cute, but um, that's something. Um, let's speak to the girls I've not spoken to yet. Even we over here, here was clean. It's not hard to see why Yunku Kafai found it so fond. I suppose that's another reason why I hate this conclusion. It's at a loss as to how though. Lord Teo's condition has improved, no doubt, causing Arthur to perk up as well. Friends, apparently. For all your PlayStation era feet needs. <laughs> she looks so happy. Aren't we? And with that, I'm actually going to end the episode here, guys. Well, I say thank you very much for watching. Join me next time when I continue the storyline. Until then, bye bye.